Okay, ladies and men, so we're going to start the class today. So first, girls, how are you? I'm fine, teacher. And you? Fine, fine. Thanks so much. What about I'm you? fine, thanks. No. Mm -mm. No. Questions. Okay, so we are going to continue. I'm going to share my screen. So give me a second. Uh -huh. Okay, can you see my screen now, girls? Yes. <laughs> Okay, we have building language. Listen to the questionnaire, complete the questions and answer. Listen again and circle the answer that are true for you. Okay, now we have here some questions. No, do you take a class in the uni? Do you and your family eat together on Sundays? And we have yes, I do, no, I don't. Okay, first we need to listen and complete the questions and answers. When we finish to completing the questions and answers, we are going to circle the truth that are by you. Okay? Do you have questions, comments about activities? No. No, any questions? Okay, so I'm going to play the listening. Page 36. 2. Building language. Can you hear the listening, guys? Yes. Yes, great. A. Listen to the questionnaire. What's your weekly routine? 1. Do you take a class in the evening? 2. Do you and your family eat together on Sundays? 3. Do your friends call you in the evening? 4. Does your best friend meet you after class? 5. Do you and your friends play sports? 6. Do you go shopping on Saturdays? 7. Does your best friend go shopping with you? Okay, do you have all the questions? No. <laughs> okay, I'm going to repeat again in the listening, okay? Thank you. Page 36. 2. Building language. A. Listen to the questionnaire. What's your weekly routine? 1. Do you take a class in the evening? 2. Do you and your family eat together on Sundays? 3. Do your friends call you in the evening? 4. Does your best friend meet you after class? 5. Do you and your friends play sports? 6. Do you go shopping on Saturdays? 7. Does your best friend go shopping with you? Okay, 
Okay, do you have the questions now? Or no yet? Yes. 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 <coughs> okay, great, excellent. So we are going to check it. Now, so do you have? Okay, the first uh, do you take home community? Okay, yes, great. So what is the answer by number five, uh, Samantha? Uh, do you and your friends play sports? Uh -huh. Do you and your friends play play sports? Uh -huh. Number six, ¿qué tal? Do you go shopping on Saturdays? Uh -huh. Do you go shopping on Saturdays? And the last number seven, Samantha? Um, does your best friend go shopping with you? Uh -huh. Does your best friend go shopping with you? Exactly, really easy. So now, ahora que ya tenemos no, todas las preguntas de aquí, necesitamos completar esta de aquí. So, por ejemplo, si vemos aquí la primera dice, do you take a class in the evening? Do you take a class in the evening? Is, yes, I do, o no, I don't. Porque la respuesta va dirigida a you, no, a, a, a tú. En este caso, la respuesta es yes, I do, no yo. Si lo hago, no, no lo hago. A diferencia de la dos, do you and your family. En este caso, ustedes. Por lo tanto, sería yes, we do, no, we don't. Right? It's this part? Yes. Yes. Entonces, vamos a completar las respuestas de las cinco a las siete. Que ya son falta.
I don't, teacher. Done. Ok, entonces, ¿cuáles serían las respuestas de las cinco que salí? Yes, we do. Y no, we don't. Yes, we do. No, we don't. Or you and your friends. Ok, number two. Yes, I do, and no, I don't. Yes, I do, no, I don't. Number seven. ¿Qué tal? Uh, yes, she does. No, she doesn't. Uh, no, she doesn't. Yes, she does. No, she doesn't. Great, right, really easy. Ok, entonces, ahora que ya tenemos completo todas las preguntas, vamos a a seleccionar las que son verdaderas para nosotros. Entonces vamos a contestar las preguntas. La pregunta número uno, por ejemplo, dice, ¿Do you take a class in the evening? Or do you take a class in the evening? In my case, no, I don't. No, I don't. I don't take a class in the evening. ¿No? Entonces continuamos con todas, ¿vale? Facilísimo. ¿Tú las preguntas? No. No, ok. Amorcito, no llegan, si las pido. No llegan, llegan bien tarde. Y ahora. I'm done, teacher. Done. Read explain. Okay, girls. So, uh, Katsadi, do you take class in the evening? No, I don't. No, you don't. So, what about English class? Is it in the evening? This morning night. It's in the afternoon. Okay, what do you, what do you think, Samantha? Um, yes, I do. Yes, I do. Why? Um, porque ya son las cinco, bueno, entre cinco y seis ya se considera como tarde noche, entonces según yo entra en evening. Uh -huh. Exactamente, yes. Exactly. Do you see a glass in the evening? No? Okay. okay. Samantha, do your friends call you in the evening? Um, they, they do. Yes, they do? Yes. Okay, what about you, Ketsali? Do your friends call you in the evening? No, they don't. No, they don't. 
belum oh tersumpah oke okay. get study do you and your friends uh, play sports? Mm, no we prefer no no we don't uh -huh. we prefer video games okay play video games what about you samantha do you and your friends play sports no um they don't no they don't okay samantha Did you and your best friends go shopping with you? No, she doesn't. No, she doesn't. Oh, that's terrible. What about you, Katari? Did you and your best friend go shopping with you? Mm, no, she doesn't. Okay, that's too bad. Get Sally. Mm -mm. Did you and your family eat together on Sunday? Yes, we do. Yes, we do. Okay. What about you, Samantha? Do you and your family eat together on Sunday? No, we don't. No. Oh, that's too bad. Okay, Samantha, did you go shopping on Saturday? No, I don't. <laughs> no. Oh, that's terrible. So you only came home. Yes. Okay, so my life is very boring. Okay. <laughs> yeah, it's true. What about you, Ketsali? Do you go shopping on Saturday? Yes. I, I do, but sometimes. But sometimes. Well, <laughs> Does your best friend meet you do after class? Mm, yes, she do. She does. Yes, she does. So what about you, Samantha? Does your best friend meet you after class? Yes, she does. Yes, she does. Okay, and that's all, right? Right? Mm, yes. yes. Okay, really easy. Questions, comments now? No, no. No, no questions. Okay, so in the next we have here grammar. Yes, no questions and short answers. Okay, we have do you go to a class in the evening? Yes, I do. No, I don't. Okay, remember, when we have a question and the question begins with do or does, it's a just no question. So usually answer with short answers like yes, I do, no, I don't, or yes, she does, no, she doesn't. Entonces, Una pregunta de yes no question por lo general no tiene el WH question al inicio, como what, como who, como where. Por lo general inicia con el auxiliar nada más, como aquí, do you, does your mother work? Y por lo general contestamos como únicamente como sí o no, pero a la hora de contestar es importante decir I do, or she does, or she doesn't, ¿no? O I don't, de acuerdo a si es positivo o es afirmativo o negativo en mi respuesta. ¿Vale? ¿Dudas, preguntas? No, no. No, facilísimo. Ok. Entonces, dice ahora, complete the questions with compared with a partner. Ok, ya tenemos la primera. Do you make 
phone call little more ok facilísimo, necesitamos completar las preguntas con dúo dos y luego después tenemos que colocarle el verbo que le falta. La primera es make phone calls, hacer llamadas de teléfono, ¿no? Entonces continuamos con todas las demás. ¿Vale? ¿Dudas, preguntas del ejercicio? No. No, oh, well, you can turn it on, ¿ok?
Teacher, don't. Yes. Yes. Ok, vale, vamos a ver. Ok, um, Samantha, can you give me the number two, please? And do your best friends go on the internet in class? Uh, your best friends go on the internet in class, number three. Does your mother check her email every day? Does your mother check? Okay, number four. Um, do your parents do the laundry on weekends? Uh -huh. Do your parents do number five? He does. Does your father see the news online every day? Does your father see? Does your father read? Okay. Number six. Do you and your bed and do you and your friends play online games together? Does your best friend take classes in the evenings? Does your best friend take classes? Number eight. Do you go shopping after class? Uh -huh. Do you go shopping? Number nine. Do your family have breakfast together in the morning? Your family have do your family eat okay number 10 do you clean your room every, every day mm -hmm. do you clean your room every day okay really easy okay so um, mm -mm, yes do your parents do the laundry in the on the weekends Yes, they do. Yes, they do. So what about you, Samantha? Do your parents do the laundry on weekends? No, we don't. Uh, we do every day. Every day, the laundry. Okay. Samantha. Mm. Does your best friend take classes in the evening? Yes, she does. Yes, she does. What about you, Sally? Does your best friend take classes in the evening? Yes, she does. Okay, get mm, Sally. Does, yes, does your family eat breakfast together in the morning? In the morning? Yes, we do. Mm -hmm. What about you, Samantha? Does your family eat breakfast together in the morning? Um, no, we don't. My mom um, doesn't break, do eat breakfast. Okay. Do your best friend go on internet in class? <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> um, she doesn't. Do your best friends, do your friends go internet in class? 
Yes, yes, uh, they do. Yes, they do. Okay. Can you tell me? Do you and your friends play online games? Mm. No, we don't anymore. No, you don't anymore. Okay, what about you, Samantha? Um, we don't. No, we don't. Okay. Samantha, do you clean your room every day? <laughs> I, not, I don't. No, you don't. Okay. What about you, Natalia? You no. No, you don't. Yes, yeah, by me. I only clean the, my room maybe two or three times per week. Yes. Okay. Samantha. Does your father read the news online? Every day? No, he doesn't. No, he doesn't. Does he prefer to read the, the newspaper? Or he don't like it? Uh, um, he doesn't. Um, nothing. He don't like it. Okay, he don't usually do it. Okay. Kesali. Uh, does your father read the news online every day? No, he doesn't. He see he watch videos on YouTube about news. Okay. Do you go shopping after class? No, I do. I don't. What about you, Samantha? Do you go shopping after class? I don't. No, I don't. No, I don't. Okay. Samantha, do your mo does your mother uh, check her email every day? No, she doesn't. Yes, she does. Do you make phone calls late at night? No, I don't. No, you don't. What about you, Kisali? Samantha, sorry. Do you make phone calls late at night? No, I don't. No, you don't. Okay, great, excellent. Questions, comments, Sam? No. No? No questions. Any comments? Okay, so we are going to continue with the next in a second. Class three. Who has a busy week? Who has a busy week? Okay, bright questions to ask your classmates. We have here you no know, the first you no know, exercise before breakfast. Okay, by by mere question of someone who exercised before breakfast, the correct question is, do you exercise before breakfast? Do you exercise before breakfast? Okay, so we are going to complete the other, the other, um, the idea is to change the sentences to a question, to really easy. Questions, comments about activity? Mm, Entonces, no. solo I, vamos a hacer la primera, eh, convertirlas en preguntas. Ajá, convertirlas en preguntas. Ok. Ok, really easy. When you get ready, tell me, ok? Yes.
Are you done, teacher? Ready. Okay, great, excellent. So we are going to check it the Ketsali. Can you see me the number two, please? Do you clean the house every day? Mm -hmm. Do you clean the house every day? Number three. Marta. Mm, do you study English late at night? Uh -huh. Do you study English late at night? Number four. Ketsali. Do you get up early on Sundays? Mm -hmm. Do you get up? Do you get up early on Sundays? Number five. Um, do you play sport on team? Mm -hmm. Do you play sports? Do you play? It? Ah, do you play on a sports team? Okay, number six. Oh, do you work on the weekends? Uh -huh. Do you work on the weekends? Number seven. And do you go to bed early every night? Do you go to bed early every night on number eight? Do you eat a snack after class? Exactly. Do you eat a snack after class? Okay, really easy. So, Samantha, do you play in a sports team? No, I don't. No, you don't. What about you, Katsali? No, I don't. No, you don't. Okay. Get Sally. Do you go to work early every night? Yes, I do. Okay. Yes, you do. What about you, Samantha? Do you go to bed early every night? Yes, I do. Yes, you do. Okay. Samantha, do you clean the house every day? Yes, I do. What about you, Getzali? Do you clean the house every day? Mm, no, I don't. No, you don't. Okay, Getzali. Do you eat a snack after class? Yes, I do. What about you, Samantha? Do you eat a snack after, after class? No, I don't. No, okay. Mm, Samantha, do you exercise before breakfast? No, I don't. Okay, what about you, Katsali? Do you exercise before breakfast? Mm, no, I don't. No, okay, Katsali. Do you get up early on Sundays? No, I don't. What about you, uh, Samantha? Do you get up early on Sundays? You get up early. Yeah. Yes, I do. Yes, you do. Okay, Samantha. Um, do you no? Do you work on the weekends? Mm, yes, I do. What about you, Ketsali? Do you work on the weekends? No, I don't. Okay. So the last, uh, Ketsali, do you study English late at night? Yes, I do. Okay. What about you, Samantha? Do you study English? Yes, I do. Exactly. Yes, I do. Really easy. Questions, comments, please? No. No. Okay. Really easy. So we continue with the next. We have lesson C. Do you work out every day? Do you work out every day? Okay. Alguien me puede decir qué significa work out? Hacer ejercicio. Ajá. Entonces, work out sería lo mismo que do exercise, right? Sí. Do exercise, work out. 
Ok, entonces tenemos ahora, ¿no? Una conversación. Pero primero tenemos que mirar la imagen y contestar la pregunta. What do you think Celia and Andy are talking about? Ok. ¿Qué Sally? What do you think Celia and Andy are talking about? About their routines. About their routines. Ok. Yeah, maybe. What about you, Samantha? What do you think Celia and Andy are talking about? Uh, they talk um, routines. They are talking about routines too. Okay, maybe. Okay, so now we are going to read the conversation. And uh, after to read, we are going to ask answer the questions. What do you find out about Celia and how about Andy? Okay, so... Samantha, can you help me reading Andy and Ketali? Can you help me reading Celia? Okay. okay. Hi, I see you here all the time. Do you work out every day? Well, I come here before class. Oh, are you a student? Yeah, well, I'm a part-time love student. Um, I work at a TV station too. A TV station? Really? Yeah, I am an intern, so do you come here every day? Uh-huh. I run here from home every morning. Oh, so do you like lie around here? Live. Do you live? Oh, live. Uh -huh. No, I live about 10 miles away. So you run 10 millions a day? Wow. Uh -huh. Miles. Miles a day? Wow. Okay. So, um, Samantha, what do you find out about Andy? What do you find out about Andy? Sorry, repeat, please. Okay. What? Do you find out about Andy? I don't know, I don't understand. <laughs> what do you find ah. out about Andy? Do you know what is the meaning about uh, find out? No? Samantha? No. Out. Okay, what about you, Ketali? Find out. Es encontrar. Mm, okay, find, que es encontrar. Pero en este caso, si la pregunta dice, ¿qué you que find out? Acerca de Andy, ¿cuál sería el significado de find out? ¿Aprendió? ¿Qué aprendiste? Mm, no exactly, puede ser, pero más bien sería ¿qué descubriste? ¿No? ¿Qué descubriste acerca de Andy? ¿No? No sabías nada hasta después de haber leído, ¿no? Y ahora dices ¿qué descubriste acerca de Andy? What do you find okay. out about Andy? Entonces, Samantha, what do you find out find out about Andy? Um, she is a student. He is a student. Okay. Ah, uh, he he is a student. Um, he um, uh, he uh work at TV station. Uh -huh, he works at TV station. Works. Station. Um, um, yeah. That's all. And he's a part time low student, no? He studies low by lawyer, right? 
Yes. Yes, okay. Quetzali, what do you find out about Celia? Uh, she runs 10 miles uh, every day. And she, she's in the gym all day. Okay, yes, it's true. And she goes to gym every day. Okay, yes, it's true. So, do you have questions, comments about vocabulary? No. No? Yo sí tengo uno. ¿Qué significa? I'm an intern. Mm, un interno, un, soy un interno, es este. Interno, ok. Otro, otro sinónimo de interno. Soy un pasante, soy un becario, ¿no? Soy un interno, un pasante, un becario uh -huh. en la estación de televisión, ¿no? En el TV station. Ok. Ok, ya. Yeah, that's all. So. We continue, ¿no? With activity. Find two good answers for each question below. Write the letters A to H. For example, the number one, do you live around here? And a probably question, a probably answer is letter C. Well, I live about two miles away. So we continue with the others to number two to number four. Do you have questions, comments about activity now? Questions, comments? Yo hablando como mucho. Ajá. Hello girls, welcome back. Ok, uh, ¿en dónde me quedé? Porque no escuché cuando se cerró la sesión. ¿Qué significa intern? Ah, ok. Vale. 
ser intern. Intern, además de ser interno, podría ser como becario o pasante. Entonces sería, eh, yo soy un becario, soy un pasante, ¿no? En la estación de televisión. ¿Vale? Sí. Ok. ¿Dudas, preguntas? No. No. Ok, entonces continuamos con el ejercicio de abajo. El ejercicio dice, find two good answers for each question below. Write the letters A to H. Ya tenemos la primera. Dice, do you live around here? Y una posible respuesta es la letra C, letter C. Well, I live about two miles away. Entonces, continuamos con todas las demás. ¿Dudas, preguntas? ¿El ejercicio? No. No, really easy. When you get ready, tell me, ¿ok? Read it, teacher. Ready. Okay, really easy. Um, Katsali, can you say me the number one, please? Uh, do you live around here? C and E. And E? Can you say me the letter E, please? Uh, no, I don't. I live in Oakton. Uh -huh, Oak exactly. Town. Oak Town, exactly. No, I don't. Okay, number two, Samantha, please. Um, letter A, A and F. A and F. Uh -huh. Can you see me the letter A, please? Uh, well, I work at store on the weekends and Yeah, I have a part-time job at the restaurant. Uh -huh, at the restaurant. Okay. Get 
Sally, can you sing me the number three, please? B. Uh, no, I'm from Chicago originally. Uh -huh. And G. Yes, I am, but my parents are from Turkey. Exactly. B and G. And the last, number four, Samantha. Um, letter D. No, I am only chill. Um, letter H. Yes, I have a sister. Okay. It's not. I'm an only child, child, and letter H, yes, I have a sister. Okay, really easy. Questions, comments about vocabulary, maybe? Yeah. No. No, really easy. Okay, so we continue with the next strategy plus. Well. Okay, we can use well, no, to store an answer, no, when you need time to think. For example, do you work out every day? Well, I come here before class. So we usually use well when we need time to think an answer. Entonces, nosotros utilizamos well cuando necesitamos tiempo para pensar una respuesta, ¿no? Como vemos aquí en el ejemplo, well, I come here before class, ¿no? Que sería similar como bueno o um o tal vez, ¿no? ¿Vale? Super fácil. ¿Tienen dudas, preguntas del uso de well? No. No. Okay, entonces, vamos a hacer el ejercicio que tenemos abajo. Dice, match the question with the responses. Then listen and check your answers. Ok. The first, no, we, primero vamos a eh, colocar la letra que corresponde a cada una de las preguntas. Después de haber terminado, voy a reproducir el listening y vamos a eh, checar si nuestras respuestas son correctas. ¿Vale? Y ahora sí. las checamos entre todos. ¿Ok? ¿Tú das preguntas del ejercicio? No. No, when you get ready, tell me, ¿ok?
I don't teacher. Page 39. 2. Strategy Plus. Well, A. Yes. Match the questions with the responses. Then listen and check your answers. 1. Are you from a big family? Well, I have two brothers and a sister. 2. Do you work out a lot? Well, not every day. I go to the gym two days a week. 3. Do you like sports? Well, I don't play sports, but I watch soccer on TV. 4. Do you study every day? Well, not every day. I don't study on the weekends. 5. Who's your favorite actor? Well, I like a lot of actors. I don't have a favorite actor. Uh, letter B, well, no every day I go to the gym two days a week. Okay, no Letter A, well, I don't play sports, but I watch soccer on TV. Number four, Samantha. Uh, letter D, well, no every day I don't study on the weekends. Letter C. Well, I like a lot of actors. I don't have a favorite actor. Exactly. Really easy. Ok, ¿todas tenían las respuestas correctas antes de poner el sí? ¿O alguien tenía algo diferente? Uh, eran iguales. Eran iguales. ¿Qué le dije, Chale? Mm, the same. The same. Ok, vale. Entonces... ¿Tienen dudas, preguntas de vocabulario, tal vez? No. No. Ok, vale. Entonces, si no hay dudas, si no hay preguntas, vamos a terminar la clase por el día de hoy. No se les olvide hacer sus actividades en recreo, please. Y nos veríamos hasta el día lunes, ¿vale? Sí. Sí. Okay. See you. Take care. Bye. Bye. Bye.